Notre Dame is number one. Notre Dame with a miracle win is the He's going again. Notre Dame and score. Jack, as you know, when you change anything at Notre Dame, it at the very least creates conversation. Could you talk about why the decision has been made to have a unique and special uniform for the Shamrock Series games? Well, as part of uh, trying to make that series unique and distinct, we're doing a number of things. Um, it's beyond going to different stadia, different markets. It's about a whole range of activities that we want to use to celebrate Notre Dame. And, and a uniform change is one part of that. It's the one time a year we'll alter the uniform and we'll do it in significant ways as we did uh, when we were in Washington, D.C. Uh, at FedEx Field last year. And uh, as our fans have seen, it's significant this year too. Is there an advantage to changing the uniform? I don't know that it's an advantage so much as um, it, it reflects a partnership with our student athletes, which is very important to me. Um, they enjoy this. It's, uh, it's, it's exciting for them. It's a fun element. They honor and recognize our traditions, but they like the opportunity to change it up once a year. And so we have decided to use this series as that opportunity annually. and. Uh, it's an advantage in the sense that they really enjoy it. Who designed this year's Shamrock Series uniform and what role did Notre Dame have in that process? Well, we have a lot of input and final say. Uh, Adidas is the principal uh, designer and they work very hard. They present us with a host of options. Uh, they, they dedicate an enormous amount of resources and talent to this uh, challenge and um, we sit down with them and go over their initial concepts send them back to the drawing board to refine some things, and then, as I say, get final approval over what they do. Jack, how do you answer fans who fear that having a special Shamrock Series uniform could lead to changes in the regular home and away uniforms? Yeah, I, I, that, uh, all I can tell them is, uh, during my time here, there won't be reason to be concerned about that. You know, our uniforms have changed a lot over the years. People view it as more static than it has become. One of the things Adidas did when they engaged in this planning was look at all the different styles of uniforms Notre Dame had had over the years, uh, and there have been many. You know, last year we we honored a request from Michigan to do something different for their first night game, and, and we'll always try and be a good partner. If if another school wants to do a throwback game, we'll we'll consider that request. But at home, we'll wear whatever our home uniform is for the year, and that will be largely a traditional uniform. There are tweaks that are made all the time from year to year, but it'll look like our traditional uniform. And then once a year, we'll, we'll do something special. Can you give us any hints about next year's Shamrock Series uniform? I haven't seen it yet. Uh, I, I haven't seen those initial concepts. They'll be coming to me soon because the lead time is significant on this. You, it's, it's essentially a year's worth of lead time to get it done. So they'll sit down with me soon and show me some of the initial concepts and and we'll react to them and then we'll go through the process of, of getting something final but uh, you know it's it, it's a lot of fun and, and and it's an enjoyable way to bring out special elements of of our program and our traditions the featuring of the leprechaun this year uh, is a way is a way to get that done that's sort of fun we featured the clover on the helmet uh, the shamrock last year uh, so um, it's 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 a fun challenge Oh! <laughs>